not noticed in, in that. And the next thing I know, the pastor rises to the pulpit and he begins preaching the gospel of Jesus Christ. And it wasn't I'd never heard the gospel before, but all of a sudden the words were virtually uh, assaulting me. And I was, I was uh, uh, amazed at how I was being uh, affected by this word. And I was essentially like this, saying, okay, you got me. I've been <laughs> stiff-arming you for 38 years, but today that's over. I, I realize that, uh, that, that I've been making a mess out of my life, and, and I want to just declare that I owe you the very breath that I'm breathing. I owe you the breath that my children are breathing and my wife is breathing. So whatever you want from me from now on, the answer is yes. You just tell me what you need me to do, and I'll be glad to, um, to adjust my behavior to respond to your requests. So I gave the Lord a, a blank check over my life at that time. How did you get involved with Harvest Evangelism? In 1992, I was uh, a, still a businessman. I was supporting, uh, partially supporting, a missionary uh, from Colorado who was head of world ministry. And uh, one day he was in my home having dinner at my dinner table, and he was telling us about the trip that he and his wife were proposing to make in, uh, uh, in November of that same year, 1992. And... So he said, how about if you and your wife go to South America, and with, go to South America with us? And I said, wow, that sounds great. I mean, I'm thinking about <laughs> going to other lands and seeing other geographic settings and eating uh, uh, you know, South American food and, <laughs> and hearing different languages. And so it's more, uh, it was more of a thought of an adventure than it was of some kind of spiritual mountaintop experience. And, uh, but that was... A, that was uh, well, we actually did go to South America. First we went to Brazil, and then we went to Paraguay, and we ended up in Buenos Aires at uh, the Harvest Evangelism International Institute on Prayer Evangelism. And no one had given me any insight on what was going to happen at that uh, institute. I just came in there with uh, great expectations, but no particular knowledge of what was going to happen. And, and uh, the first night, the uh, two of the top uh, evangelists of Argentina uh, Carlos Anacondia and Claudio Freitason came to the welcome dinner in an upscale steak restaurant and uh, and they sat at Ed Silvoso's table. Ed Silvoso was the head of that ministry, Harvest Evangelism. And uh, and uh, they after dinner they asked if they could pray for the guests. And so Ed Silvoso said fine. And so uh, they took their jackets off and stood at the one end of the restaurant and all of a sudden lines formed and people were receiving prayer from these two guys and my wife and I just looked at this we had never seen anything like this and so I said I I want to go up and try that out and my wife said oh no I'm not going anywhere near that and so I, I'm an early joiner I, I want, I'm a, an inquisitive type of guy and I wanted to see what this was all about so I went up there and and uh, Claudio Freitason prayed, prayed over me and when I came back to the table I said to my wife I don't think it uh, it, it accomplished anything special. It was just nice to have that prayer. Why was I in for a surprise? I went back to my room that night, and all night, my wife went right to sleep, but all night I didn't sleep at all. Mm. And I began to see things leaving my body, and I now understand that I went through a spontaneous deliverance uh, all night long. And uh, when I talked to Ed Silvoso the next day about it, he said that Claudio Freitason has an anointing of holiness. And when he prayed over me, God... Uh, release that anointing of holiness onto my life and so wow. anything that was not from the Lord had to get out and that's really what I experienced that evening and that was quite a remarkable experience and it it brought me to the point where I remember a phrase that I heard in Argentina so well some things are caught more than they're 